How's everyone today? So I really wanted to eat this today and so I went to the supermarket and got this. It's very popular and came out uh, about a little over a year ago. You should be able to find this in many international or large supermarkets because when I was traveling in the past year, I saw it in the countries I visited. So it should be available if you look around. This four pack at the supermarket costs more than the average. That's because it's sort of in a premium category. Obviously with a slightly higher price and the noodles are a little bit thicker and so is the sauce. And the more expensive ones tend to be in packs of four while the others are usually five or six. If you've eaten others enough, you'll notice the taste difference immediately. It's always the small details that make the biggest differences and so the higher quality taste. The package is slightly stronger it doesn't rip open that easy as you can see and that can be a good thing because you don't want to rip in it quickly as that can spill the broken pieces all over which kind of gets annoying to clean up and there weren't that many broken pieces which is actually good by the way have you guys ever just cooked the noodles and eaten it that's the feeling i had when opening this and just looking at the noodles or i just wanted to you know break it into pieces and eat it as a snack anyways here are the packets this is the vegetable flakes, the vegetable oil, and lastly we have the sauce powder. Always a great thing. When I cooked this, I was really hungry because I came from the gym. So I ate this one quite quickly. It's really easy to cook and all the packets open up easily. Usually with oil packets, they tend to be harder to open and so you spill it, get some on your fingers, and that can get messy and really annoying. But not this one, which I was really happy about. After you get the water boiling, total time to cook should be no more than 5 minutes. It's very simple. And I always prefer to eat it normal right out of the packet. I don't like to add other ingredients or make it look fancy. To me, this is a snack, not a meal. I just want to eat something really quick and simple. And this is really popular for a reason, because it tastes really good. The most simple way I can describe it is that it's higher quality taste and you'll notice it immediately. The thicker noodles and the sauce, it really stands out. I was reading that they were not trying to make a new or different type of taste or some kind of new trend, but rather they just wanted to make a taste that was authentic compared to the real one. And it would taste really good. Lately, a lot of higher quality stuff has been coming out and I'll do reviews of those also. You guys just let me know if you have any questions or requests or suggestions. Okay, so time to do something fun. Sort of. And I highly recommend you all not to do something like this because it seems fun and cool to do, but you will regret it immediately and it's not healthy at all. And I did warn you. Well, I was thinking after every review, like once a week or something, maybe do like a mini challenge or you know something cool like this. So I decided to cook up the rest of the package, the three packets that are left, and eat it all in one sitting without taking any breaks. And what makes this hard is that it's hot. And the longer you take to eat, the sauce gets thick and cold, which makes it even more difficult. As you guys are watching this, I'm curious, what do you think? Do you think I was able to do it? Nearly every single person I know can only eat one, or only eat one. Maybe, just maybe if they're a big eater too, but three, no way. Now we're talking about the average normal person. It's just not normal to do, eat more than one. In the past, I would actually eat two packets a lot, but that's before I realized how much it was affecting my health in a negative way. This stuff just has too much salt and it's really going to make you feel bad afterwards and for the rest of the day. The fact that I was starving helped me a lot. And if I wasn't so hungry, I'm not sure if I would have eaten it at all. It wasn't as bad as the other challenges that I did. And that was because I didn't have friends making me laugh and, you know, trying to tease me and stuff. I got full around eating half of this. I just didn't feel like eating anymore. And if you wait till the end, you'll see what happens.
So I was able to do it and it didn't feel that bad like the other one. So yeah, we'll probably get more of these coming out. Anyway, talk to you all soon. Bye.